Hi guys, in this video I'm gonna give you uh, um, some quick tips about um, how to um, put uh, the Mobius on a GoPro 2 or 3 uh, gimbal um, in the sense of giving you uh, the position of the of the Mobius so that the gimbal is balanced and uh, or at, this is uh, what I have been doing while I'm waiting for my, my GoPro I will uh, use the Mobius in a gimbal I just uh, got. This is the one I got uh, in, uh, in eBay. Um, I looked quite a lot and I'm very satisfied on, on the, this gimbal I, I got. I, I will put the link in the in the description. Um, it comes uh, to my, uh, completely assembled with uh, the motors and the, and the control board. Um, so it's essentially plug and play. I didn't want to mess up, and um, the price I think it's uh, it's pretty acceptable. So um, basically, um, um, what I had to do is to put the the Mobius in a position that uh, that uh, is uh, in balance, both axes, and uh, I came out that taking the um, roll axis of the gimbal as a reference in this direction the center of the gim the, the Mobius is 35 millimeters um, from as I said this uh, this axis then from the top if you take as a reference the support of the Mobius which I use because I have another quad so I want to be able to remove the Mobius, so I use the support here. If you take the rim of the support here, this is 30 millimeter with respect to the center of this beam, which is 10 by 10. And this beam is centered in the platform. So it's centered with respect to the axis of the, of the pitch uh, gimbal axis as well. And then the third dimension to get a balance, balanced uh, configuration is the height. Um, as I said, I use a 10 by 10 millimeter uh, wooden beam, um, but I use it. I used also um, double side tape, which is around my one millimeter. So you see up and down. So the Mobius support should be around 12, between 11 and 12 millimeters from the, the platform. With these dimensions you get a pretty balanced of course it's not uh, this is yeah the pitch motor um, has some uh, the magnetic um, the magnets of the motor keeps it from really coming back completely but this it's uh, quite balanced actually so if you move around and then another thing that um, might be interesting for some of you is that uh, have the Mobius is that the, the um, cable to get the video out of the Mobius and the power something like that mini USB um, yeah is pretty bulky so sometimes um, yeah I was forced to bend it and so on so that I can put it um, where I uh, where I want so for this quad with the gimbal I decided to open to get one of the my uh, Mobius USBs and if you take for example one um, cable cutter like that not very big um, it's not actually that difficult to cut the with a bit of care to cut the the plastic that is uh, is around the, the original USB. This was like this one. So if you can start cutting with care, you end up with all the cables and the soldering actually. Visible and then I put some uh, epoxy so that um, it was uh, protected. 
this also makes it uh, much nicer and uh, comfortable to to pass the cables through different uh, positions so um, check the videos I've made with the first uh, test of this gimbal and um, yeah thanks for watching